Right, James, down to 10 men, away for a moment, the league leaders could have been on the wrong end of a heavy scoreline, but I thought the lads battled well and you yourself pulled off one or two really good saves. Yeah, I thought first half especially, even with 11 men, our shape was good. We knew that we'd have to give up some of the ball for them. Um, we wanted to be on the front foot, we wanted to, to be aggressive and press high, and then obviously the sending off kind of changes plans, but I thought after that we, we shifted the lines well, we were structured, um, kept our shape, got in at half-time 0-0, um, and then the second half, it's again more of the same, trying to shore it up. We change formation to, to kind of counter their threats, and and then a lot of the lads cause a bicycle kick in the corner, and it just their crowd gets behind them, and then obviously the second. But for us, after after that, we we wanted to try and play with freedom. We had ten men against eleven, but we thought, okay, first ten minutes of the half, go long, try, take the crowd away from them, and then. After that, we tried to play with ten, and I thought we played some good stuff without really obviously threatening their goal, but. But look, they are where they are for, the re for a reason and good luck to them. Were you unsighted with the bicycle kick? Just looking back at the replay, it looked like it kind of... Oh, yeah, you can't, can't see anything. The lad's got his back to me and then so there was a defender in front, I can't remember who it was, and the lad chests it down and then just, I think it shanks off his foot and just goes into the corner and as a keeper, you, you can't see the ball and the lad puts it in the corner, so there's not much you can do with them. Um, but yeah, it obviously gives this place a lift and, and yeah, they're a good side. I think they've only lost sort of one or two games here all year. Their form's been really good. Um, but for us, there's, again, there's lots of lessons learned out there and it's playing in a hostile environment. We've got a lot of young lads in the team and I thought they stepped up and did well. So, some of the topic of being unsighted, a couple of times in the first half and they had a free kick, their scar, I think it was, their centre-back, kept standing in front of you, is that...? Yeah, just, just don't, they're trying anything, obviously, to, to throw me off. Um, but no, they're, they're very good at what they do, they're a, a good side, they move the ball well. And, and yeah, they, like I said, they're the top of the league now. I think they only need one more win to go up. But for us, like I said, there'll be a lot of lessons learned from today. Um, playing in, like I said, an environment like this and, and defending well and, and remaining structured and staying patient and not jumping out and, and breaking the structure. And uh, I thought the lads did, did really well in front of me.